Lake Audubon is a popular fishery in central North Dakota, so every three years, summer and winter, the Game and Fish Department conducts krill surveys to find out how many people are fishing and what they are catching. Uh, we do the surveys to get uh, estimates on like how much pressure a lake will get in a given, given winter or summer. We combine all that information uh, for the entire survey period. We can compare that with past years and see how one particular year will compare with other years. During the summer, anglers are interviewed as they come off the water. In the winter, it's a completely different approach. Creole clerks uh, in the winter time, they'll travel out on the ice talk to anglers on the ice at the different spots because there's so many different places they fish. Erica Seveny is the krill clerk this winter. She asks questions like what are you fishing for? Have you had any luck? How long have you been fishing? And are you satisfied with your trip? They've all been really great. There's been no problems with anyone answering questions. As soon as I tell them what I'm doing, they're more than willing to answer my questions. But the winter does have challenges that summer clerks do not have to contend with. Well, if there's been some very cold days. The one day the truck showed negative 10. And I mean, that was not including winds, but thankfully most people have nice warm houses that they let me come into to warm up while I'm asking questions, so it could be a lot worse. If the anglers do have any luck, the fish they catch are part of the survey as well. The clerks ask if they can measure the fish, so they'll measure them and and we compile all that information at the end of the year and it'll give us uh, you know information on what's the smallest fish they catch, what's the biggest fish they catch and keep, what's the average length of the fish that they're catching. If you're fishing Lake Audubon this winter and the Game of Fish Clerk stops by, take a few moments to help out as your information is important to the lake's future. This is Mike Anderson in the North Dakota Outdoors.